Okay, the next uh, operator, I think that's what I decided to call these things, is the uh, mirror horizontal. So you see two triangles facing each other, kind of mirrored. I think that's a, a really good icon for this operation, actually. So uh, let's try that. We'll do it on the first bar. Click mirror, and that's what happens. So let's see, when we mirror horizontally, the E is a dotted quarter, and that should go to, uh, that E should begin on B3, uh, it should, the second eighth on B3, right? Let's see. Yeah, that's what happens. It ends up on the second beat of, of B3, the second eighth note of B3. That's where it ends up. Let's turn it off again. So the F on beat four in measure one, that will mirror over to, uh, it'll go from beat four to beat one, right? And that's what happens. Okay, so that's your simple uh, mirror. Of course, this is a great, uh, a great operator to use in making melodies, uh, mirroring. I think I saw some YouTube video where, uh, well, no, uh, one of the most famous uh, uses of this type of thing is by Rachmaninoff in Rhapsody on a Theme by Paganini. So he takes this really catchy Paganini uh, melody and... Uh, what he does, it's similar to mirroring. Um, I think it's a vertical mirroring. Uh, they call it negative harmony. Uh, you can read up, check it out on YouTube. It's it's actually kind of complicated when you see the theory behind it, but I think it's pretty similar, um, if not actually the same as just a, a vertical mirror. Uh, Maybe not quite, but it's in the same ballpark. Uh, anyway, that's getting uh, too far afield. So the vertical uh, operator is straightforward. Uh, let's try it. Let's try it on bar four. Let's see what happens there. with it on and here's no mirroring it's better without let's try bar three no it's better without let's try bar two terrific um, operator that will work and give really good results in the right uh, with the right melody okay and by the way uh, if it's not clear uh, another wonderful thing about this melody editor is that you know you just have it playing and you can start clicking on these operators and see how it sounds you know and it may be that they typically uh, don't improve things, but now, you know, sometimes uh, you're going to get good results and you'll hear it. So you get this instant feedback, and it's just so easy to do. I mean, imagine doing this, uh, even if you were playing piano, uh, you know, if you were a very good pianist, doing this kind of uh, mirroring, uh, it would still be a bit tricky, 
I think you'd have to uh, think about that before you just started playing it. So um, that's the mirroring mirror mirroring operator. Sorry, and then the vertical obviously uh, mirrors everything vertically. Okay, all right. So I'll see you in the next video.